Hi everyone, Bob is in the house and today I decided to do a morning session uh, because usually, actually if you look back uh, on my channel, I was reacting to Kygo when it was morning or like daytime, you know, uh, usually I react in the nighttime, but when it comes to Kygo, his music is kind of chill and nice, you know, uh, melodic and it kind of fits more to this kind of vibe and you can even hear I don't know if you can hear it, but like I can hear um, birds like chee -chee 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 doing that <laughs> there, um, you know, their typical sounds. Basically, it's chilling, it's nice, fresh morning start, and I'm really gonna be pleased to hear new Kaigo song. So let's get into it. Kaigo, think about you, featuring Valerie Broussard. First reaction, let's go. Okay. I don't know why, but this production reminded me of Avicii, actually. Um, yeah. Rest in peace. The aesthetic, you know, it's kind of similar. Okay, um, usually on the second verses, Kaigo likes to switch it up um, make something a little bit different than it was on the first uh, verse before the drop because you know Kaigo wants to uh, keep the song interesting throughout the whole thing but here I didn't really notice that um, I mean it's not a really bad thing I'm just saying I'm just noticing things <laughs> waka waka Shakira <laughs> Damn, alright, that was good actually, that was really good uh, Let me dive into lyrics a little bit I'm just checking um, on the lyrics like right now to see like properly fully w what's happening. Uh, I already caught uh, some uh, lyrics by myself and the reason why I wanted to check is because like some, some things I, I was uh, hearing, they were relatable, uh, they were nice and uh, right now after reading uh, the lyrics I, I can fully explain what it is about. So basically it's about a breakup, um, you know, and then after a breakup, you know, time passes and like you start to miss your uh, ex, you know, ex-boyfriend, ex-girlfriend and uh, you know, you think about all this wonderful time, uh, all these gr uh, good times, you know, you, you kind of forget about like bad times or why you broke up, you, all, you start to Id idealize that person after the breaking up and then you want to, uh, you know, you were thinking about maybe we should uh, go back and, you know, reconnect and uh, be together again. Maybe it was a mistake that we broke up, you know, and like uh, they're mentioning how, uh, you know, we've been quiet, say we, we, we would try it for a while, meaning um, we would we would try it like, um, I, in my, I think uh, w what that means is like we, we've been, we will try uh, like to move on and like uh, maybe date other people and see how it is like uh, without you particularly maybe the, the grass is greener on the other end without you like we will try to work it out without uh, you my love for example uh, but um, you know but they're saying that but that was years ago you know and like meaning it <laughs> we try but it's like you know it's still the connection with other people it's not the same as it's 
as it is with you, as it was with you. So um, I'm still thinking about you. I'm still, um, you know, maybe like we should get back at least like reconnect, meaning like have a, a cup of coffee together and then like talk about the past and like uh, say everything we wanted to, you know, like we've been keeping uh, inside of us all this time. So uh, and like they're matching. I cut the tr tree down that we grew, like meaning uh, and, and also like still I cannot go back to the places we knew. So meaning like uh, he he or she like uh, they try to like sort of remove everything that uh, will cause them to remember uh, their partner, right? So, like, he cannot go places he knew. For example, I, myself, like, uh, I was kind of lucky because uh, my partner, uh, my ex, she was living uh, outside. Um, no, sorry, not outside. Like, she's been living, like, quite far away, like, uh, 20 to 30 minutes uh, drive. So, I usually don't uh, hang out uh in the places we uh, hang out before because you know we were usually like hanging out like next to her uh neighborhoods and stuff like that i mean also in my uh like other places where i usually go but like uh most of the times in those places so i've been kind of lucky uh to not you know to not stumble upon the places uh where it would give me like uh, emotions um, memories, you know, uh, feel make me feel sad. I mean, I still was sad, of course, for a year. But um, yeah, you know, like uh, the song is talking about that, and um, it's really relatable. And like, I'm not sure. I, I think the the song is like kind of saying, I still think about you, and I actually want to reconnect with you. At the end of the day, it's not showing that direct intent. Like, it's not saying that. Hey, let's get back together. But you can you can feel that energy. Um, so that's it when it comes to lyrics. It it was great, um, relatable. I like it. And uh, Kaigo has a great song on his belt yet again. I like the cover art. Like his face is like a mountain. And it's like shh, like uh, flying away. Sort of like we're like I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to forget Kaigo because he was my partner. You know, like in my memories, but like I cannot quite forget him because like I still have that, you know, um, half of him in my mind, and like the top of him is a mountain, meaning like he's still great. You know, kind of. I I'm, I'm understanding that. And if you don't mind, if I can keep you a little bit longer, uh, I actually have a story about Kaigo. Basically, uh, last summer I went to Las Vegas, and there was a time when Kaigo was performing I don't, i'm not sure what hotel that was but when i was in las vegas he was performing uh that night and the tickets were pretty cheap like we were like either 25 dollars or 50 dollars something like around that and you could basically like just go there and get in and like we were happy about it like me and like my parents like we were just uh we wanted to uh go there and we went there but then you know, we should have, of course, booked uh, the play like our maybe tickets or something like that. I, I'm not sure if that was possible or I, I don't even remember this point. But there was walk-in basis too, and like when we went there, the line, <laughs> oh my god, is so long, so crazy. And like we also came unprepared because apparently that party was like a black and white. I'm sorry, only white. Um, so like you could only wear like white dress or white shirt, like, you know, white outfit basically. And we just didn't come with that. You know, I was in shorts and like um, color, colored shirt. And uh, yeah, it's just, it just didn't work out. But I, I could have seen Kaigo actually. <laughs> you know, I was kind of, I was kind of close to see Kaigo live uh, DJing out there in the club. It was, um, it would have been great. Would have been great. Nevertheless, Kaigo, a great artist, um, yet again proves that he is awesome. I'm glad that I'm seeing this song actually trending uh, on Apple uh, Music. Like it's it's among uh, either top ten or top fifteen songs in Apple Music in U.S. Apple Music, which is really uncommon. We usually don't see in the United States 
like DJ songs like by David Guetta or, or Kygo, um on the top of the charts. But it's it's quite kind of happening right now. So I'm really ha happy for that. I'm really excited. And that's it. I will not waste <laughs> more of your time. That's it. Hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to this channel. Definitely do tell your friends about this channel. Subscribe and um, also don't forget the notification bell to get uh, updates when I upload my video. All right. Goodbye.